Some good golf clubs are in there, aren't they? Let's have a look at there. Is that yours? Uh -huh. I think that's mine, is it? Yep. Yeah, that's your new one. Yeah, it's beautiful, huh? That's all right. That's okay. Do the same thing going back. And just fold this up a bit. Fold this up. Yeah. Fold that up. And then follow it through here. Yeah. So fold it up here. Fold it up a bit here. Butter, get it going. Back and down. Yeah, good. It'll feel flatter, but it's not, it won't be that much flatter, but I think you've got to let your head and shoulders go a little bit this way to, to give you the turn. Because if you keep your head this way all the time, your body gets locked in like that. Yeah, good. You'll get more power like that, especially with your longer clubs. But it's just a little bit of this, because your spine's all connected to your head. And if your head and shoulders are like this, you'll never get your shoulders to, to go around, right? And your arms should be a little bit more... Flexible. You don't have to keep them straight. You know, it'll be easier on your body as well. All right. Uh, Freddie, you didn't hit any today, Freddie? John, hit a couple. Oh, look. I haven't seen you swing for years, so... Oh, I've seen the ones Luke sends, but you send Luke. Some of them, yeah. What was he trying to get you to do? Um, Got to keep this smaller. So narrow, yep. Yeah, too wide. Yeah, that stops your body a bit. Yeah. This arm could have come in. On the way down, like Hogan. Yeah. Top of the left arm on the body. Comes this way. Yeah, that's right, yeah. That's trying to swing inside. That's what we all tried to do. I was just trying to actually show them. Yeah, it, well, not so much with the cob head, but just more, just more letting this arm go like that one does. This one goes like that, that one goes like that. And that's about. your trap, right? That's your trap. See, so a lot of this stuff, well, I had in my old swing, I'd give it the, 